The Highland Clearances by Emma. The sad and emotional times when the Scottish were forced to migrate to Canada, America or Australia and was not nice for the Highlanders because they had to leave their home. After 1745 everything changed. Many people migrated into the factory towns of the lowlands. The Highland landlords had shared their family now they were introducing new farming ideas to make more money they grew their own food they now need to buy food managers were employed to oversee the farm work and taxmen were no longer needed the taxmen were the people who bought the land the ways they farmed changed when st Clair was president famous farmers did not rely on crops to feed them they relied on the sheep sheep farming became more popular because they would make more money the green yards owned by alex monroe the landlord was a country estate on which there were a number of cottages where families lived but alex monroe wanted to have the land for his own use and so he tried to get the families out of the cottages so to do this, the Hector was the first boat to immigrate on a 11 week journey which took the first settlers to Pictou and Nova Scotia. The ship Brilliant came from Aberdeen on April 12, 1842, heading to Quebec, which had also picked up passengers in the Black Isles. You have to pay six to eight pounds to get on the boat. The Helku sailed from Cableton in 1853, bound from Australia, and had already picked up passengers from Sky. There were 830 passengers on board during a voyage to Adelaide. Lasting seven months, 56 people died. According to a doctor on board, passengers were a few weekly condition. All the people were of very shabby, warm out conditions, badly suited for a long and wintry voyage.